design the play is designed to do. And so, other than that, though, off the top of my head, I I thought he did a, a real good job. He should have gone around. Again. Yeah, he should have pulled the ball. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> at least enough they wouldn't have challenged it. Do you care um, how many people are touching it? I mean, would you like to have maybe a core of guys, or is it the more the merrier in terms of playmakers? Or? I think it's how the the game kind of dictates itself. I think we do have some specific things to say. Hey, we need a we need a play. Let's get it in so and so's hand. The, the guy that uh, you know we were trying to get the ball to on, on certain occasions was Corey Smith, and and with just the way the play worked out, either the protection broke down or the coverage was different than we thought it might be. Uh, would have liked to, to see him touch the ball maybe a couple. Uh, I don't think he touched it at all. Would have liked to see him touch it a few times. But other than that, I, I think you know the the defense and the, the coverage and the front and all that stuff kind of dictates it. But we can at least put the checker pieces where we think they'll, they'll have the best opportunity to, to did, touch it. Did we get to see more of the, the full Dontre today? I mean, you talked about the limitations he had last year, but he was doing a lot of different things. Uh, yeah, yeah, I, I think, you know, we'll continue to use him in that role. But, uh, you know, with, with everything that was going on inside, the game plan quickly evolved to, hey, let's get the ball on the perimeter. And, and him and Jalen and Curtis were the guys that we had targeted to, to get the ball on the perimeter.